Hi! I wanted to make a video sharing what I use for this Calla Lily inspired look. Um, there is no tutorial because it took me about two hours to do like everything, so it would have been too long. It's not as complicated as it might look, maybe, to you. So like I was saying, it's inspired by Calla Lily. She's an amazing artist. I will put links up to her MySpace. It's private, but if you're a friend of hers, you already know what I'm talking about. So I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I need to interpret this into makeup, like, ASAP. And usually when I make, you know, when I do stuff like this, I like to chart out what exactly I'm going to do first instead of just like going for it. Here's my face chart. I drew it out. Use the bleeding heart and then you can't really see, but that's um, what I was going for and this is what I got. The outcome. Um, yeah, so I'm going to start with this eye. First of all, I used Max Beijing Shade Stick as a base for both lids. And then on this one, all I did was put a whole bunch of NARS's China Blue eyeshadow all over. And then for a highlight, I used Facefront Cosmetics Ice Melt. Looks can be deceiving because this looks extremely neutral. That's what I thought it was. When you put it on, it's like an amazing burst of like blue. You can see that. You'll be able to see it better in the pictures, but it's really good stuff. So again, that's Face Front Cosmetics. For the heart, I drew it with my hand, just, you know, like freehand. That's probably why it's a little, I don't know, it looks kind of funky to me. It's not what I pictured, it's not exactly what I wanted, but oh well. For the heart, I mixed, we didn't make max mixing medium, I used clear sky blue pigment and marine ultra pigment and just drew that in and then to for the drop I use Ben Nye's Magic Color Paint it's just a liquid paint this is five dollars at Nigel's Beauty Emporium and that's it just like a smoky eye and then I just drew it on there and there's glitter there if you can see just for a highlight I use Lime Crime Unicorn Glitter oh my god that I just spilled all over my hair. But it's okay, because it's a really pretty blue. So it's all good. So again, that's Lime Crime's Unicorn Glitter. Very fine. It's not a typical glitter. It's very, um, like the pieces of glitter are really, really, really tiny and soft. It's really soft. That's this, this half. This side is a little bit more intricate. I wanted to do another cut crease look, but instead of doing like what everybody else does, which they'll like put like a light color here and then cut the crease with a darker color and then just have it blend away, I wanted to start with light to dark and then from here go light to dark. So from inner corner, light to dark, then from the outer corner, light to dark instead of just, I don't know if that even makes sense, but for that I pretty much use the same stuff. For the inner corners here, this here and out here, I use Max Clear Sky Blue Pigment, and then in the middle color I use Marine Ultra Pigment. These are pro colors, and then the darkest colors here and down here I use Nars's China Blue again. I love this color. I want to go out and buy like five more just so I could have it for the rest of my life. Oh, and then for the highlight, I went back with Face Front Cosmetics Ice Melt. And to cut the crease, I used MAC Crushin PowerPoint and Light as Air PowerPoint. Light as Air is a lighter blue, and I use that over here. Crushin is just a dark, really dark blue. And that's pretty much it. And there are little dots if you can see. And that's just mixing medium and the clear sky blue pigment. On my cheeks, I use NYX or NYX Presto blush. And on my lips, I have Max Violet Gloss mixed with Dusty Coral Pigment. Just want to share because last time I cut the crease, it was really bad lighting in the video that I made. So the only thing people could really see were the pictures, and a lot of people assumed that I had photoshopped my pictures. So this is for you, for all the people out there who think I photoshopped my stuff. If you were to see me in person, this is what you would see. 
this is what it would look like. Probably a bit more vivid because this is the artificial lighting, so just say no. And I'm wearing um, my new green contacts, so. So, yeah, like I was saying, this is inspired by Kella Lily. She's awesome. I'm not going anywhere right now. Like, I'm not going anywhere today. This is, for me, this is a bit much. I don't think I could leave the house like this. Unless, I don't know. Where would I be going with this? A carnival? A rave? I don't know, but... I would probably wear, like, something like this, like, to a club or something, but that's just me. It's all a matter of personal preference, so... My nails, they're blue and orange. I just did them. There's a tutorial for my nails, so if anyone's interested... Yep, that's it. I hope, uh, hope you liked it. I hope it was, you know, cool. And thank you for subscribing. If you have, I really appreciate it, and... Thanks for watching my videos. Okay, <laughs> bye.